Hello and welcome to Entertainment News right here on YT54 TV. My name is Philine at Philine Jin across all socials. Welcome, welcome rather to the show. It's going to be fantastic. We have an amazing show lined up for you. Now, if you're joining us for the first time, we know you. We you already know actually. We are all about gossip, celebrity gossip, and trending topics. That we are all. That's what we are all about. Now we are on Facebook at YT54. We have a post. Go comment below. Do let us know where you're watching us from and uh, your contribution to the stories we're going to be covering right and then at the end of the show if time allows it we're going to be sampling some of your comments the hashtag is y254 updates now you already know i don't do the show alone i have the gang gang my co-hosts for today and they are very amazing <laughs> okay well kevo has been here before vance hasn't been here so i'm gonna start with him when you have to introduce i'm gonna say we home i want to be to nani in social media then we move over to kevo okay okay this is my first time here <laughs> <laughs> very true i'm vance dj on all social media platforms that's facebook and instagram vance dj one word and i'm happy to be here ah Thank nice you. Thank you so much for coming through kevo <laughs> Yo, Wagwan people, come Kawaida, Kevochi Music, aka Rice, aka Mr. President, aka Rice or Sarabu, and your Chelsea, aka Chibe. Yes, sir. Kumura, you are nickname. Eh, Lazima, Lazima. All right, now welcome to the show. Like I said before, we are on Facebook at White If I Foot Corner Post, so go comment below. And we'll sample some of your comments at the end of the show. Now, let's get started with our first story. While well, the Kenyan arts industry suffered yet another blow over the death of Churchill's show comedian, Othwal Othwal. Now, his death elicited mixed reactions amongst netizens who accused Kenyan celebrities of negligence. Now, comedian Jalango and Otos strongly opposed the accusations, noting that they supported the late to the last minute. However, what has sent the internet into a frenzy is the allegation that his battle is going to cost between 700,000 to 1 million Kenyan shillings. According to a statement given by the comedians in Kenya Society chairman, Ken Waudo. All right, Maze, Othol, rest in peace. He was a very funny man, Maze. You've served your purpose. So our condolences goes out to your friends and family. Okay, now back to our story, Maze. You guys, you've seen this story make like a trend for the longest time. Othol, Othol. Um, there's a post that was making uh, rounds on social media. I saw his claim he was unable to pay 15000 the bill but then Jalango Mesemar, that's not true because they were there every step of the way they came to his uh they actually uh, had a group he was actually uh, scheduled to go for an operation he okay he had tb so according to jala actually according to like alkwa he had a love for the bottle that was a tb was he skip like uh, if you're supposed to take them for 60 days, you can't skip a day. Na kama ni sasaba, una take sasaba. Asiyo ti sasaba na daka moza. So, ali observe for at least a month, alafu haka choka, haka fika mali, haka anza kuchanganya TV. And that, like he left, na, like na pombe, so haka acha kukumeza ku, dawa. So that was bad. And then, while they were still, he was still recovering from that, he haka patata na tumor. Or I think it is a brain tumor, if I'm not wrong. He was scheduled to go for an operation. Unfortunately, my doctor will call me goma. So by the time they were ready, that's when he left us. That's according to the statement given by Otos Najalas. They actually talked about it on their shows. But then, kuna wakenya wengine, wamesema, eh, Buddha, pale tuko mseli kwenye interview. Wakasema, ana, like, waso memuacha, sujuini ni nini, like, ange afford kulipa 15k ya MRI. So, I don't know which is which. So, uno naje, nani nasema ukweli? Ni jalas na otos, ama it's true, like, kuna time tu mabeshte uchoka pia kukusaidia. Mi, hii story mse, mine za tu sema, mtu wanajo ukweli, ni otolo, otolo. Yeah. Ni hile tusaa hezi kwa area tuambie hii story ilikuwa aje. Mm. But, hii ndi yomsea kuna, hakuna ukweli yote. Yeah. Yeah. So, siwezi, siwezi ingilea. Kila mtu hakuna sayi yake, mini kuna sayi yangu. Yeah, you 
Mm. So personally, <laughs> personally, <laughs> say yangu, mm. me the first time I heard of this news, mm. I was just on the green app, pitia pitia. So the first post I saw, I was like, ah. In Syria, Zama in two fake news. Yeah, then the next the person, uh, yeah, yeah, evil, evil. So the yeah. next one, the next one, so ni kaku, ah, kumbe kitu ni serious. Yeah. Say. So I don't know literally mm -hmm. what went down. So mm -hmm. I can't say that somebody's wrong or the other person is right. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, Chibe, welcome Sani, Buddha. <laughs> He's actually a gospel <laughs> artist. So, I would want to be like, uh, what's your take on all this? Like, the fact that. Kuna point, I do himself come to like, uh, according to an interview he did a while back, like, Akwana Doya MRI, which was just like 15k. Na sayi, matanga maze wa nasema ina na kukos kituka mita. Buddha, one million. Mita. Mi kwanza, kwanza, kwanza wacha ni jibongo. Najua, uh -huh. uh, it's so sad that last minute ndo wase uka amin. Mm -hmm. Na, ile time una wa call out na wambia ni aja I need help yeah. wasi wana nika una joke yeah. na unajua as a man ndiyo tumerezu wa ukiwa na shido fai kusema sana you find your way to the top but at the end of the day kama una una mm. una get na mi, mi ushinda online sana na li check your story youtube aki, aki narrate vila kuwa fiti ya mekuwa msik and all that na hiyo kitu hili ni umiza sana za artist because kuna venye tu yani unaweza na marafiki ni kweli walikuwa wame, wametoka yeah. as much as unajua wengine wao walikuja tu ile time yenye mm -hmm. ameka hiyo clip wasio mm -hmm. ame notice ndio wasio anaanza kukame yeye wana yeah. try ku help yeah. so una una na wasio wengine walianza kusaidia time ya kukiaji nao nika PR eh hey, unajua mm -hmm. wasio kam last minute cause hata mimi kuna msani fulani nili meet tu ni brother from coast na nilianza kukaa na yeye all of a sudden akakuwa mgonjo mm -hmm. so Nili reach out kwa mabeste zangu wale na Joan mabeste zangu na siti hawana do yeah. na Joan wako na pesa yeah. that's why nili reach out to them nikwambia ni aje niko no boy ame come tuna work na yeye sahi but ni mgonjwa unaona yeah. na wanasema nafafanye tu hiyo scanning bado ya yeah. kichwa pia alikuwa na issue yeah. so wase wa, ile unajua wase anaenda missing in action <laughs> wase ana kucha <laughs> pia <laughs> wase ana kucha pia maombi nini <laughs> so for me uh, mimi naweza big up wale wase alisema man not wall mm -hmm. Kuna, of course kuna wala wasi wafiti bado we mm -hmm. can't ignore mm -hmm. that but yeah. it's so sad that wase ukuja tu last minute last ndio kitu mimi naniboka bisi yeah. usikuje last minute kama uko na uwezo mm -hmm. wa kusaidia mtu msaidie cause you don't know tomorrow no but i also have a problem with them um, okay not like a problem but uh, i have a question kuna wakenya wale walikuwa wanasema oh ma celebs yeah, au oh, ma celebs wanasema vile ati walimsaidia walikuwa wapi mbona wali neglect sijui nini tusidanganyane tusidanganyane mbona <laughs> okay, sio yangu ni mbona wakenya wa kawaida pia nao wasisimame na mtu wake wa msiki kama the moment someone is uh, ah, mi, famous kwa sababu ah, shida industry no, ah, no. mimi as a side na wase mm -hmm. wa the normal people unajua mm -hmm. sometimes wajua mali wanaweza to reach sometimes yeah. wajua what you are going through yeah. unless yeah. kama ni close friend that mm -hmm. ah kivo cha melalanja mm -hmm. yeah. but ule fan huko nje kwanza especially kiniona kwa tv kubwa kama hii unexpect eh ni kwa nimeja kwa fiti kwa na do una get so my fans pia huko nje wanafaje pia wasanii upitia easy yeah, nini yeah, yeah. but again to the artist mm -hmm. uh, uki notice uko na problem jibonge tu yeah. na get there are people out there wako na ropo they are willing to help mm -hmm. na wanaweza simama naye hata ushangae yeah. because we have seen now hii time ya covid kuna wasanii wa organize ma show mm -hmm. pale youtube wapi na people wamekuwa kituma dost direct kwa yeah. msanii hadi ma dj dj na mimi kusaidia manze pale facebook kulikuwa na ile ile facebook ya ile platform wa kwa dj cheza were you ever there i was there but sick way and the lives come the lives wale mangata poku ku support mimi nilikuwa tu hapo nyuma nikituma ma tips kidogo dogo support in Zambia ya ilikuwa diaspora DJ to fight for diaspora yeah aha iliokolewa si wengi sana 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 ukienda live unikapo pigi eh unapata matiti manze so at least kuna watu wanasimama na wase so wasanii wa bold enough kama unapitia kitu abonge manze eh na si lazima iko wasanii so kuna wasi wa kawaida wasaidie si ndio eh wasi watu mempesa hapo unaongea na wase unaona venye kama jambi sijui kama unajua jambi yeah quick high yeah, yeah, yeah. fire mama unaona hey, kuna time kuna time, time alikuwa na noma yeah. yeah she's a fighter wase wali come through kama mkolea sasa yako sawa yeah and yeah. she actually got better na take kwa Kenya alendadi majuni yeah. yeah so we should take the hashtag is y254 update on facebook talk to us 
So we'll be at the end of the shot. We have to show you some love, right? All right, now on to another controversial story. Our controversial singer, Will Paul, on Tuesday got a 19 year old rising socialite, Shakila, arrested of, over what he termed as trespassing. Now, Pose took to Instagram and shared a uh, a police OB number uh, from Lalongo police station and claimed to have called the police to arrest the 19 year old who he referred to as Goliath for stalking him. Shakila on her end denied claims and insisted that she was set up since Pose invited her and later roughed her up before having her arrested and she had to post a bail of 50,000 bob to be released from prison. Now while well, Pose later posted that she, uh, he actually is suing Shakila if she she doesn't come clean and speak the truth and that she should keep uh, she should seek help because she is clearly not well so who is fooling who like because i story me in chakanya i mean i don't even know what is going on anymore yeah, yeah. shakila where shakila shakila mesumbua we actually last week too and the week before we were here on this show we talked about shakila shakila she's 19 Apparently, um, I can online like some oh, but then me me go involved in Otile Brown and I will pose. I can let you any ama. I can say my name again. Uh, Brown Mauzo. I do OG OG. Kwanza ka I can mumbi. Eh, I can kujia ka say my oh, but then OG si ukweli. We all have to do it part time. Wow. wow. Yeah. And then she went live with Exyandela. I can find you something again. I did. I was like, what? She's nineteen. Like, okay, you will learn some more. So we can't talk about what she did online, but it was. Overrated, you know. I love Kamene. Had her on the show. Kamene, I can get an eh. I can maybe. You know what? Like, don't do this. I can say, "Mommy, change." Barely one week after interview, <laughs> no scandal. So sorry, I'm pose. But I just saw actually that you pose like that. Nato angoma, Shakila, to conviction. You know, kidogo you know, na. Oh, police! You saw it's serious. You know, I don't know. But then, uh, go be number you can go with Paul, and that no, Willie Paul, that's not his real that's name, that's not his real name. You know, name. so I told him, okay, now, police station, I thought you write your real name, yeah, yeah. I yeah. I yeah. yeah, you know, what do you guys think? <laughs> First of all, this girl, she's 19, yeah, she's a teenager, mm -hmm. I love her, yeah, so number one, she's a cloud chaser, mm. oh, so any cloud, I'm gonna yeah. check it, I'm check so, Utapata Udem. Maybe I can have my sabuzake. Kuna kuna venya na chess cloud. Pose na tu namjua. Pose tu nakujua na hizi masanda. Zaidi tu nakujua. Tu nakujua upenda kuchesa. So me na ona tu apa tu mechesa tu mechesa. But 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 you didn't tell me. I can't give you story. What kind of kubisha na na pose? Pose kama mimi chana na mimi oni juu si juu ni 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 ni. Kida go udema menda kuake. Unana. First of all, pose ni sema she broke. She, she broke she, in. She broke she in. Broke in. So come on, he break in. I live with you, Kapoze. Now I got to watch CCTV. Now CCTV, me show to be zero your demo key. A king here. Me, me, I think. I'm not mad. I'm not forced entry. Now she came and I said, "Ma, she was set up at Kapoze. I'm invite. I love by day. I come with you as carry. So I don't even know." Me, me, I think uh -huh. it will happen. Eh, Kapoze, ni kama walikuwa na kaki tu na udem, mm -hmm. na katoka udem. Sa udem ni kama tayi kubali ameto. So I could barely to story issue. What you say? Because come on, you could break in. Udema me juaje ko ako. Na kwa yu CCTV footage pose ame toa. Udema kuna mali ame jifos kuingia. Like every day to come, ame pita. CCTV na shoto ame ingia. Kwa na lafa na sima at least you he feels threatened. How is he threatened? She's nineteen. So I don't know. Are they you they have in store? Who is boss? Who is the 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 boss? Who is anataka tu kwa famous yeah, yeah. of which simba and my strategy <laughs> but ni young man zio unajua anafa anafa at take it slow unajua hii game itaki asira kama hiyo yeah, itaki 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 yeah, kwa sababu unaweza lala ndani <laughs> lakini will pole pia anatucheza na pia kidogo ni kama umepanga ile shughuli alafu na band alafu na geuze hiyo msupa unajua like yeye kama hadi anaita ude goal yes no, yeah, because he spoke very really nasty things about her. And as a mobile, oh, where is Julie? I'm like, wow, 
Unajua Mi by the way twende to story next. Uja Uja mama amesumbua sana. Hii story tuongee baada ya kesho. Hii pole amesumbua sana. Mnaongelea hii pole kesho kutwa kesho. Atulie bana. Atulie tu. Ana chest cloud. Asante ngoja. Sikuna tena alikuwa ameoa. Sasa hata ni na juzi ametuambia alituambia ameoa sio wife wake anatoka jamii. Wewe kia kali sura ya TV na kaka oa. Alikuwa amesema mwanzo Mario. Mse alikuwa amesema ameoa. Akasema wewe wife wake anatoka sio jamii. Alikuwa si ni mzungu. Kulikuwa na mwingine alikuwa mzungu wake. Kamudi ndogo hivi. Mimi naweza sema we mali safi na biashara. Eh. Na mimi ndio kufanya biashara. Eh ni mwana biashara. Ako na damu kiku kiasi. Eh, bika po kiku yomanze mu ni inspire. Asa ako na damu yao kiku yukimpango. Se ni dojo. Lakini controversy ni nauza. Unajua wala si magadhi. There's no good and bad ni publicity. Ni nauza. Lakini unajua yeye ni msani wa gospel na anafari. Sinabene alisha toka. Sinabene alitoka. Nadhani alishuka. Ni blanda. Uki jana badu waende Pombe flan ni kawiski Unajua kuna mali inaongele about the love of money kwa biblia Uja mama ibi alianza tuku kafunga sana Unajua hido inakuja sana Adi wezi reject juu Unataka kufanya vitu meja Na at the end of the day Unakuanga na principal za gospel artist But inafika malu unanga kusema hii ni kikatai pesa ndani na ile gari nataka nini unagea so mimi na sema hii ni ku backslide but uja ama bado tu wako na maybe nikaibia kwa wana gospel maybe events ni mara moja moja apana kusema kweli unaona hiyo time kwa namdansia tukio wadu gospel kwa napiga gig mob sana unaona tulikuwa na travel hata mimi nime travel sana juu ya will fall na Siyazi sema iti ni gigs. I think pia, there's something me as a gospel artist pia ndasema. Sometimes tuna judge too sana. So kuna vele mse pia kijaji wa sana, huu ute ndu kuprove wa se wrong. Muna ni judge wa sa minta kukumi. Ata nifangi vile mna ata. Eee, ndio sasa ni wafraisho na get. But at the end of the day, angali the consequences that it are later and all that. Because I'm very sure meipote za fans na pia me gain. Yeah, kuna unya me gain na kuna unya me gain. Ni risk move, but anyway. That's what we call for us. It's it's working out because soon after that, Sasa Izzy is going to be ambassador of my drinks. You see, and and I know right now he's making good money. He's making good money. Ali, when I was sitting here, I was just walking. Like in the morning, you must hear shilling and bill. You must hear shilling and bill. Ah, you must hear. Ah, you must hear. Miss Joanna, you are not going to be a video. 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 Let's head over to the next story. Well, after the, no, after the first uh, case of coronavirus was reported in Kenya back in March, schools were closed and students sent home. Now, with schools reopening, a video has gone viral of a school having female students sprayed with a disinfectant from a pesticide sprayer before accessing classrooms causing a star online. Now, most online users condemn the act, saying that the disinfectant could be harmful. Actually, have a video right Allah. there. Allah. <laughs> <laughs> Wah, kenyang siang. Kata ni kau muk, kau ku. Eh, so, mula mula jual ni kau naik video. Nau nak tu mangombe, mangombe sah zina line up, zina line up sah zina nza, zina nza kau famigated. I'm saying you see right, see right. Ah, zina mina nak katul dip. Ah, zina aman nau nak saya main dah kau syabak ya manza kumogia ni ni mamboga, mamboga dah. I'm saying you see right. Kenya kupamoja Kenya kupamoja kupamoja Uwezema Kenya uhami Mina sema unanuja ama kwanza alikuwa na wafanya yo kitu Napa tumuise tu mkutano nyuma atent Kwanza unachuki yo kipara Na kana shahid Awa kakiara kana shahid Oh ni kofia mepiga Inatelto a lot about whom sema Aha Like, but but at at what point do you think that is right though? It's, like, it's not about him when you're spray because he's not just really job alitiwa. But come on, the school management. Do you think it's right? No, it's not a matter of is it right? It's very wrong. It's very literally very wrong. Yeah. 
Because kwanza I imagine this stuff kwanza ni wet alafu mnaenda yeah. class. So mnaenda yeah. hivyo it's uncomfortable. Alafu mimi niko na smell flow. Alafu unajua sasa sanitizer. Unajua sasa sanitizer. Sanitizer, sanitizer. Yeah. sanitizer. sanitizer. Uh-huh. sanitizer zinakuwa zimechapwa ma perfume so yeah. at least kana ukia ukia. Eh uka uka haraka. Na boy di master yo shule. MC wa hiyo mtaa. Washiko tu achapwa ni boko. Unajua? Yaani hizo ndio vitu tunafanya wazi. Ina <laughs> 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 Bye wait 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 my question should i just do you know that 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 you Ndio <laughs> Pole 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 walimo shilangu. Sasa na walikuwa wana time asita taja jina. Walikuwa wana time kama tuko class as in atuko kwa dom. So kitu wangefanya mapema alafu by the time tunarudi kuingia kwa dom at least hako karufu kameshu. Kameshu kwa nakumbuka mawendo zikuwa zinafunguliwa. So unajaribu kuimagine mse sami ni meweka mkono. Eh? Famigate famigate mbaka ni pinduke. Azi. Azi. Tunatafta kungudu. Atutaki usunguliwa kisoma ba. Wee. Lakini hata hiyo bana kuliko hii. Unajua kuguni yeye inaweza kutatishia uko hapo unasoma nini? Eh. Hapo tiko na aibu kwa kuguni ndio. Kuguni. Alafu alafu ina ina hiyo ni jeshi tumeishia. Wewe unangoja mgeni akiingia. Sasa hizo ni zaka anaweza kutawala eh. Na hizo ndio. Anyway, let's head over to the next story. Well, now a video has gone viral of a woman who stormed in a church to stop a wedding just before the bride and groom exchanged vows. In the viral video, rather, the woman says that there is no issue between her and her husband, adding that they didn't even quarrel. She said he left for his secret wedding from their home that morning, and she had no idea he was remarrying. Now, um, in the video, the woman even brought kids with her, claiming they were the grooms. Let's have a video. Let's have a look at the video right Ndak 
Ngoja ngoja mimi nitaambia nitaambia huyu mzee kitu moja viva viva ngoja kwanza haiku happen ngoja kwanza ngoja kwanza nikwambie huyu mzee ni ile kazi zake haziko under to right huyu mzee alicheza clean wewe unasikia kuna wife kwa nyumba wametulia wamedozu siku umefika morning huyu mzee ametoka tu kama kawaida ni kama eh amepiga luku vizuri ni kama aenda job au mashughuli zake kumbe huyu mzee ameenda ameenda wedo ameenda kuoa wife ana ana rjuni wife na mangapi Nile tu nile tu umse 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 ni mwai umse ni mwai moja they were married legally or uh-huh. divorced ah uh, they divorced no so my question is walipangaje hiyo do julana kuna mse ana officiate na hadi kuna invited guests that means familia ya boy ya dewa sio ngoja kwanza sio na sio na kuambia umse umse ni mwai ndio sababu nime nimemwapla nime umse ni mnoma <laughs> wewe unataka kuniambia uko na wife si ndio na watoto na watoto tayari wache wa team office Ndio kusema kwa mabeste zake. Jina kando wa connection na connection hivi kiasi. Wamepanga fiti ametulia tu At least na ma bridesmaid best best man as in kila mtu kwa hapo hivi wazi niwezi uwezi shuku kabisa usaidie kwa kwa yake. Sipo. Sipo. sijui <laughs> Wako Nairobi wote eh? Wote wako wako town moja actually. Same town. Yeah. Wamelala pamoja usiku. Pamoja usiku. Ameamka morning na bibi anasema wako gombani. Ah wako gombani kabisa. Kile jamaa anatafuta kiti ya chairman team <laughs> office. So unajua ukiwa secretary. Lazima 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 upige upige nini? Ni bibi ya so kaiona. Wewe lazima li travel Kenya. Lazima ni travel Kenya stay kwa mali ta gani. There's a research that was done uh, I think last year. Okay, so Kenya has the most faithful men in Africa. Wow. Yeah, we are faithful. Hata kana ongea. Ulisikia wapi? Hata ah ah lakini wacha hata ulisikia wapi? Mimi niko faithful. Mimi niko faithful. Mimi niko faithful. Okay, kwa faithful mimi Mama yangu. Najua marriage ni kitu poa by the way. jamari. Lakini ni kitu poa because vile ni observe. Mse ukipenda wife yako mpende tu. Na kama una feel kuna issue wrong na nini na nini unaweza approach hata pasi wako si ndio yeah. na muongee useme yeye mimi napitia hii challenge nini solution si kwenda ku get another side chick <laughs> ukidhani uta solve side chick huyu ni wife number number 2 wife hmm? number 2 unajua first time you want to say you may you may now kiss the bride ingekuwa end is that because when aulizanga speak now all forever hold your peace that's all if you can't speak now he Jeshi kafika, jeshi kafika na amejiami ameji mpaka na hivi ni kwa mbongo. Unajua mjaona BFF ya Obi ya Rusia akijaribu kuambia madam, eh chiza chini. Chiza chini, chiza chini. Don't touch me. Unasema ma BFF come through ba. Unajua unajua kwenye mwanaume sasa amebaki amesema tu hapa kumenuka, hapa kumenuka. Ameanza na shule za mpaka juu. Unaanza kupata mwanya huyo anaenda sana. Ni mwanaume nimefikiria aina ya place ya kupitia. Huyo ndangoja ako hapo hivyo anaunganishwa amechukua kisu amemdunga something bad inge happen uh, unajua right. so tunafaa kuwa careful pia na decision tuna make as men yeah hiyo wacha ibaki hapo full stop 
Steve Simple Boy, mimi na zawambia tu aliwaimbia vijana. Tuwe shimu ndoa. Tuwe shimu. Ala. Tuwe shimu ndoa. Ah. Yongo mna DJ bang. Tusikume yongo mna ifike huko bang. Tusaidie, tusaidie boy chandi. Tuwe shimu ndoa. Ndio, shout out to Steve Ball, ndio. Yes. Kijana simple sana. I'm sorry. Now it's clear COVID-19 has he does had in one way or another. Most businesses have been closed down with people uh, losing their jobs. And now just when things are slowly falling into place, now Big Club is once again allegedly facing issues from Kili Mani Welfare. Now, see what you're doing story at Big Club. Now, okay, when I do Kunyangi, Gengi Club, but you're doing a Big Club. Do you need it's like one of those clubs? So, Kili Mani Welfare. You know, you're going to last year, and you're going to clubs and Gong Road. So, you're going to Kili Mani, you're going to Pesa, and what's happening. Because it's actually. Uh, when I say, like, according to them, they paid everything, stories are name, money, money, money. Misha shubilikia, alafu tena, ndo wa wa se, wanda wa tena umekujiwa. Yo, our welfare, wana jita kilima ni welfare, wana taka tena ufungu. And you know, they they have like, uh, they've employed a lot of people. Unajua, tuangali ye stories are job, maze, clubs are closed down. Ngoja kwanza, ngoja kwanza, ngoja kwanza ni wambia kitu. Number one, history kilimani inakuwa watu kilimani kila mari sijui kilimani nani sijui kilimani sijui kilimani imefanya nini mpaka watu walikuwa wanasema kilimani kilimani sijui ni gidhura imeomoka walai tena au sasa pumui after this i want any facebook kuna kama ni ile kilimani sijui mam group ya kilimani mam sijui na iko na wafuasi iko mpaka na wafuasi hiyo mam siko mpaka na wafuasi milioni huko ki post tungo ma kuna hit. 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 Kuna a club has a lot of workers there, if you don't know. Mm -hmm. Starting from the bouncers mm -hmm. uh, to the, the guys that clean those toilets, Malunenda, yeah. mm -hmm. the waitresses, mm -hmm. us DJs, as in. Mm -hmm. So basically, if you shut, out, shut down mm -hmm. a club, you're actually costing a lot of jobs to people. Yeah. Because yeah. basically, a lot of people are going to lose jobs. Yeah. I don't know Nikoni in Afungwa, but. Literally, kwanza kama hii time ya COVID, mazina kwambia artists and DJs, those people have been working in clubs, maze, we've been going through a tough time. I'd say that. Misani wa gospel, what do you have to add? Paza sauti tukusikie. Kwa na hapo ni ni asadaka. Mina sikia wawe mefungwa kiasi, at least wasa merudi drawing board kiasi, unachora life, nini, unageta. But on the other hand, niki flip the coin, wasa mepoteza job of which seek to poor. Because, hey, COVID imefanya wasa me struggle sana. Familiars mob, unajua uki ujuangi uo mso meandika job behind the air na nalisha watu wangapi, sindio? Yeah, so at least, kama waneza letter two measures poor, and I'm very sure, mtu wote hapo inja kwa willing ku, ku follow hizo measures wasofanye job unajua yeah, kwa, sab yeah, yeah. kwa sababu at the end of the day wana dish hapo unataka wadish wapi unajua yeah, exactly. ni kama tu history ya vile keja zinabomolewa sijui kibera wapi na wapi na hata uja, ujaambia wase unaamka asubuhi unaamka asubuhi unapata tu i'm so sorry i'm just going to say shout out to club bubbles maze unfortunately these stories are really way is being affected you ni club mu fanya karaoke Mm. And I feel so bad. Anyway, so uh, your social media? Uh, uh pale Instagram ni at Kevochi Music Official. Mm -hmm. Na pia Facebook <coughs> ni Kevochi Music. Mm -hmm. Ya Q. Na YouTube, pia, because vile yeah, tunasema he's an artist. Yeah, mneza subscribe pale Kevochi Music. Mm -hmm. Na very soon na angusha Bonge Langoma. Bonge Langoma. Yes, yeah, stay tuned, yeah. right. subscribe, show now. Yes, I love the judges. Alright, where do people find you? Okay, you can find me on you can find me on Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube. Mm -hmm. Eh, TikTok ni lingia juzi, ni lingia juzi ya sijuku na endaga aji. It's Vance DJ, V-A-N-C-D-E-J-A-Y. It's one word. Just Vance DJ utapata. Alright. I DJ, I also make beats. Yeah. So they beat out.
Yeah. Vans DJ. Yeah, yeah. Across all socials. I reach out to him and say, I love you. Um, a big shout out to everybody who tuned in. I want to shout out our uh, Sensory Princess Hendrix. Thank you so much. Eman James, Asante Sana, Moscato Rapper, Ken Adwizi, Weru Paul, Ero Steve, uh, VDJ, Teddy Boy, uh, who else? Amish. Uh, thank you so much. Lady Supu. Kevo Pondies, Kelvin Marsh, Bede Asli. Thank you so hey, much, guys. Sick. It's always a pleasure. Shout out to Sue right here in studio for holding us down. Puna Zeth, uh, Hampson Kim, Timo, uh, Puna Timo, Kuevo, Maurice. Hi, thank you so much, Frank, and just generally everybody who made the show possible. Kila mtu na kwa hii set ni mgonjwa, believe it or not. Like, everybody is actually <laughs> I don't even know how that happened, but yeah, that's what happened. But we're gonna see you again next week, then even a better show. But thank you so much for watching, and thank you so much, guys, for coming through. Uh, thank it's you. It's been fun. You. See you later. Bye. Yeah. Cheers. Bye. 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 Mm -mm.